Yo, what's going on boys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Akai and today I'm excited to bring you guys the latest 1.4 patch notes for X Defiant. Great update. They fixed a bunch of things. Pretty excited for these changes. I'm not going to lie. I've been loving the game so more. I think the only thing that the game suffers from in general right now is just the lack of content. There just isn't much to do, but I hope they'll be adding a lot more things. But first, let's jump right into it. So first up, now kill assists will be contributing to your ultra charge, so make sure you rack those up. Also, they fixed an issue where players would get booted all the way back to the main menu after finishing a ranked match. It was very annoying, to be honest, but not anymore. Uh, if you're struggling with the EMP grenade base challenge that because it wasn't tracking your progress, give it another shot. It's definitely been fixed now. Also, cleaners, listen up. So your incendiary drone no longer will blow up when it flies over an allied GSK commando shockwire. So some finally some friendly fire relief. Now moving on to the maps. So on the national zoo map, there was actually a glitch where players were invincible um, at their initial spawn point on the second floor. So that's been patched, so no more unfair advantages. Zone control had a bug where all the zones would suddenly unlock, giving the attacking team an easy win. Uh, the bug's been squashed, so now you've actually got to earn your victory through the right way. Now here's the big changes. So the snipers, what you need to know is that the hit flinch penalty has been tuned, making it harder to land a shot while under fire. Also the spread reduction duration, the time it takes to focus and achieve pinpoint accuracy, has been increased across the board. 4% for the M44, 28% for the TAC-50, and 16% for the L115. Again, it's the spread reduction duration, the time it takes to focus and achieve pinpoint accuracy. Additionally, aiming sensitivity while using a sniper scope has been reduced to compensate for field of view changes. Oh, and if you've been rocking the Skullduggery skin on the AA-12 shotgun, the PEQ-15 laser sight will no longer be hovering above like it's some kind of ghost. There was just a weird graphical glitch that they've been fixed. Another glitch that they fixed is with a mecha skin uh, that was making your attachments invisible. Not anymore. They fixed an exploit that would let players deploy unlimited devices by changing loadouts in spawn zones. So that means they could spam grenades or EMP grenades or something across over the spawn. But no more unlimited spam now. Getting stuck by sticky grenades even after dodging them? Well, not anymore. That's been addressed. And to be honest, that is one of the biggest changes that they've done with the netcode, which is a very, very good positive for them. Now. So explosions will be sounding a lot better especially when you know you're spamming grenades um, plus you'll hear those spider bots actually creeping up a lot more clearer now so definitely watch out for that and the last few changes that they've made is players can no longer spam entering and exiting the game lobby it's exhausting and now it's been blocked plus now you can report and block other players on the scoreboard when using a mouse input and of course they've thrown in some general crash fixes that's it for the 1.4 patch notes. Jump into X Defiant. Check out these changes tomorrow, Wednesday afternoon. As always, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I am very excited to see that sticky grenade change. You know, they're working on the net code, which is nice. I am very happy to see that weapon. Um, I am very happy to see the sniper nerf come in as well. Uh, and I'm, I'm glad that they're making general changes to the spider bots as well, man. Uh, so far, you know, it's slow, but it's been steady. And, um, you know... I like it so far. Other than that, definitely let me know what you guys think. If you guys any more, if you guys have any more changes you would like to see, let me know in the comments down below. Other than that, make sure you like and subscribe if you want to stay up to the latest X Defiant news, class videos, and everything like that in general. See you guys in the next video. Peace.